Hello everyone, in this tutorial I will show you how to create super realistic skin details like a scan. So if you want to learn something new, continue watch this tutorial. Let's create a scan details like this. This is a scan data details, and we will make uh, remake these details here. Okay, so we have uh, always three layers of uh, displacement. So I made these alphas in Photoshop that you can use in ZBrush. I will put a link in the description down below so you can go and download it. So here I have a micro displacement that I made and you should bring a intensity down and maybe to 8 and add this details okay and the next step is I think it's a little bit intense but let's uh bring intensity to maybe seven now is better all right so this is our micro displacement okay so we i made uh, also a skin holes in uh photoshop that you can use here it's a gray mid value so i change a mid value to 50 and you can add a skin hose and bring intensity up and start adding this hose here okay and slowly we add the skin hose for our face don't rush and just slowly add details so at the end you have a very nice high quality details for the face that you created so yeah just drag it you can bring intensity down if you don't want it to be intense so i will speed this video up all right guys we have a skin holes and here you have at a skin direction top of these details so you just select a skin and this alpha here you can find it it's at the zbrush default alpha and you need to change the mid value to zero because it's black background is black and yeah just press alt select a, a spray for your alpha and with alt just add this skin direction so bring intensity down and add this skin direction you can change uh, change your brush size down and start adding this directions just like that okay So as you can see, we have details like this scan data only with three alpha, okay? And you can work more on this. You can add more holes and just work on this and make it more 
uh, realistic okay so you have the tool you need to spend the time on this and create it. and you can uh, you can after creating this you can uh, take alpha out of this and use it in your project okay so I made also a lips alpha so you don't need to spend a, a lot of times creating a lip wrinkles so you can just drag this I will show you you can drag this and have a very nice lips details the intensity should be around 24 and yeah that's what you need just drag it up just like that super cool details for the lips with just one click you don't need to spend a lot of times so if you save time you can do more freelance projects so it's we have uh, not very flat lips so I just a smooth and now go back add more details with just one click okay it's just a drag and you will have a lot of cool details on the for the lips okay so yeah you can add a micro displays top of that so you will have a lips data like a, a scan okay so let me bring intensity down to maybe six add this micro displacement and just like that we have a very nice details here and also you can use other alphas I have an alpha for the uh, nose also so if we smooth here we can add these details these bumps for the nose and you can add micro displacement on top of that for making it realistic like a scan data you see here it's exactly the same and my alpha is maybe I think it's a little bit better than the scan data so yeah it's very nice alpha that I made for you guys so you can use it on your project so if you wanna use this alphas you can download in my Gumroad I will put a link in the description down below so hope you enjoyed this tutorial you learned something new and please make sure to like and subscribe